Welcome back to Lex Journey with Spirit. I'm your girl Lex. I'd like to welcome all of my new and returning viewers and subscribers to my channel as your support is highly appreciated. If you haven't already done so, please be sure to hit that like, share, and subscribe button down below. That way you and I can continue to stay connected through Spirit. Now, I have a reading today for you guys and I think you guys are going to be very interested to find out exactly what does your masculine think of you currently? So we're going to go ahead and do a general reading on For the Collective to find out exactly what this energy I'm currently picking up on. All right, stay tuned because you don't want to miss it. Hey, y'all. Now, I know y'all can't wait to hear about what's going on. All right, so we're going to get a couple of pull cards to see exactly what this energy I'm picking up on is all about. I keep hearing like doppelganger, like <laughs> copycat doppelganger. You can't get with this <laughs> bubble yum, bubble yuck. <laughs> so somebody definitely feel like somebody yucky. So let's see exactly what's going on. I'm definitely like a little in awe because this energy is serious. All right, Spirit, what's going on with the collective? Any messages for the collective today? Any messages for the collective today? Any messages for the collective? Can I get any messages for the collective? Don't do me like that. <laughs> any messages for the collective, Spirit? You need to know. Spirit, you holding back. Thank you. Like I said, doppelganger, clout chaser, bitch, y'all in my space. <laughs> so, somebody definitely is dealing with a doppelganger or a clout chaser. Somebody who's trying to live off of your reputation. Okay. So, we got a clout chaser here in the mix of this. So, this who, 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 who is this clout chaser, y'all? Spirit, clarify this clout chaser. Who is this clout chaser? What's up with this clout chaser, Spirit? not do it like that so let's see what's going on with this clout chaser all right what's up with this clout chaser all right spirit <laughs> don't want to give no messages okay so this person Whoever this clout chaser is, they was like, you wanted me to leave. Divine feminine. Okay, so this message is definitely for the divine feminine in reference to whoever this clout chaser is. I keep hearing spirits say, I'm holding back because it's, it's, it's real nasty. Okay. Well, I believe the collective can handle nasty. Okay, so. <laughs> and I said, God said, okay, if you insist. So, whoever this clout chaser is, I'm definitely getting the sense that this person is manipulating somebody's divine masculine. And this clout chaser, I feel like they watch you. They watch you hard, too. I keep hearing spirits say, it's like you told somebody to leave because you wasn't going to be, be, the, be the third wheel. Yeah, and you told somebody to leave because they were selling drugs. They were selling drugs or they was in the streets all the time. Like, this person wanted to be a thug. But you know what they say about them thugs? You know what I'm saying? It come with a lot of problems. And thugs come with a lot of problems, y'all. Especially when they trying to be Billy Badass. So this clout chaser, they got involved with this clout chaser. And this clout chaser is trying to gain clout from you. I'm, I'm getting the sense that this person may have stolen your pictures, may have created a second page, may have created fake accounts on other forms of social media, media that you don't even be on. And when I say media that you don't even be on, I'm talking about like OnlyFans and all that other type of stuff. Like they really be posting up like they do. And this masculine is caught in the middle. 
But it's like they feel like, well, this person wanted me to leave. So, you know, it's like they helping this clout chaser in a sense is what I'm getting. Whoever this masculine is. Who just dusty energy here? Yeah, like this person's spirit say it's not natural. Whatever they're doing is not natural. So it's it's like, oh man, I don't know why I keep hearing social media pages that they don't be on. So it be they be pretending to be you. They may I'm hearing identity theft. So somebody may have tried to steal your identity or steal your likeness in a way. But I'm definitely getting the sense that somebody that took your pictures and posted them up on like dating websites, going on dates, tricking themselves out. I'm hearing tricking themselves out. Okay, this card. Like literally. Spirit, they don't take that. You want the bottom one. Yeah. Break up to make up. So this person, whoever you were dealing with, they do a lot of breaking up to make up. I keep hearing, break up to make up. That's all we do. Mm. So yeah, they definitely be in and out your life like it's nothing. And I feel like a lot of you guys be letting them right back in too. Like, hey, I missed you. Where have you been? Whole time they've been chilling with this damn clout chaser. The only reason why they come around you because they need they need something from you. Divine feminine. I'm definitely getting that this is like some type of karmic masculine. Like this is not even your divine masculine. This is a karmic masculine. Somebody that you deal with and you thinking that this is your divine whole time. This is a karmic shadow fake tail masculine this person not even the real deal okay so this person comes around to gain more access to you i feel like there may be some hidden sex tapes i don't know why i keep hearing hidden and then sex tapes okay yeah this card keeps trying to come out every time i try to bypass this card and put it back in the day it keeps coming back out so Spirit want me to put it on the table. They said, stop ignoring me. I'm sorry. You got it. All right. So this person definitely is trying to live, is living for myself. So they're definitely utilizing your likeness to live for themselves. They're taking something from you. I feel like somebody may have had something missing out of their home. And you were like, I know I had this here, but I don't know what happened to it. Or do you know what happened to it? Like, I feel like a lot of you guys may have went to this person and was like... Where is it at? At the bottom of the deck, tooted and booted. Tooted and booted. I'm going to just pull, spirit say pull it out. Okay. Pull it out. So this person was definitely in your life to toot it and boot it. They were making videos. I'm hearing making videos secretly. Secret videos for these hoes. I hear I'm making videos for these other hoes. Okay. So this person may have been taking this media and pretending to be something with somebody else. And it's like somebody, somebody's very jealous of you. And it's like they were doing this to humiliate you. Because they really didn't want to be with you. I have two cards that flew backwards. Out of the deck. Flew backwards. Okay. These two cards flew backwards. So this person may be in the music industry. Or maybe you're in the music industry. Or maybe you're trying to be an actress. Or maybe you have something that. That is like always in the public's eye. But it's like they're trying to ruin your reputation in a sense. Some and, and you may be trying to figure out why do people, why am I getting nasty comments? I'm hearing somebody say somebody left a nasty comment on your page about a, about something. You were clueless. Somebody was clueless as to what they were talking about. Whole time this person is pretending to be you. Yeah, this person is definitely pretending to be you. Yeah, they're definitely taking your image and trying to pretend to be you. They got somebody that's a doppelganger. I'm hearing doppelganger. So somebody's definitely pretending to be you. In a sense, they're definitely, they're, spirit, spirit keeps saying this person not only wants to be you, but they'll take your skin off your back too. Oh. So everything that you do, this person watches. And then they take it back to somewhere else and use it. Yeah. 
spirits say slowly they will lose it all because everything that they've done thus far like i, I feel like a lot of these people may have a tip to try to steal your identity um access your bank account information it's like this person found out who you really was like whoever this doppelganger is or this clout chaser it's like they did they ride in your way because they're trying to gain whatever type of popularity like some of you guys may be extremely popular where you're from people may watch you or may admire you yeah wants your gifts like this person wants your gifts whoever this cop chaser or this this doppelganger is they're only coming around the tooted and booty they want your gifts they don't want you to succeed they want to bring you down through humiliation and and and, and shit like that like they want your career they want whatever you got going on because they don't got nothing else going on. They don't got nothing. The only time when they got something is when they're trying to take yours. I'm hearing they also may have stolen money from you. And that's why I keep hearing, like, you ask somebody, did you see something? Like, I could have sworn I had it here, but it's not here anymore. You know what I'm saying? Like, this person definitely is trying to manipulate a situation or... Somebody's going to find out that somebody's been using their images. I'm hearing somebody found out somebody was uh, stalking their Facebook page through fake social media accounts, stealing information. Yeah, this person was Patty Love. This card fell on the floor like, don't love me. It fell just like that. Like, this person was a chase of running or pet of love, but I hear, I hear Patty Love. This person was not who you were meant to be with. This is definitely like some type of karmic masculine who entered your life pretending to be your divine masculine only to try to steal your gifts, your wealth, your 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 images, your like I feel like a lot of you guys may be business owners. I'm here. I got my own money. I don't need a man. Ooh. So somebody got their own money. They don't need a man. Yeah, whoever this person is, they buying time trying to stall. You know what I'm saying? It's definitely a boy. <laughs> or a man. You know what I'm saying? Like, this person is definitely a boy or a man trying to buy time. They buy time stalling just so they can get more out of you. And I'm, I'm, I'm getting the sense that there's like some hidden camera that was put in your house or somewhere near you or maybe they may have tapped into your webcam. I'm hearing somebody tapped into somebody's webcam and be watching them. And, and look, and in the most creepiest way too. And they be uploading this shit and putting it on other websites and be pretending that it's them. Like, this, whoever this karmic-ass person that they're with, this karmic masculine is with somebody that's helping them. Yeah, a sneaky link. This sneaky link that they be linking up with gave them this idea. And this person is like a thief. I'm going to just put it like that. That person's a thief. They look, spirits say they do it again. They'll do it again. They're going to keep doing it again. But I feel like a lot of you guys may not know who this person is. Because some of you guys may not even be in a committed relationship. I, I feel like this person may be your main person that you deal with. But a lot of you guys haven't signified a relationship with this person. Okay? And this person is just using you to get more out of you. Yeah. A lot of you guys, like, you got me fucked up. You got me fucked up if you think you about to keep using me. Thinking that you about to uh, continue to try to steal my shit and make it seem like it's yours. I feel like a lot of them even pretended like your crib was theirs and told everybody, look at my crib. Like anything that you got, they pretended it that they pretended that they had it. Like it was theirs. You know? Like this person has definitely pretended that your shit was theirs. Like no bull. Like, I, I don't know how to put this, but this person is definitely demonic. Okay. Spirit, can you clarify this? Okay, thank you. I couldn't even get the I couldn't even get the word out. And Spirit just threw the card out. Okay, thank you. Yeah, informant snitch. So I definitely feel like somebody may be watching them or maybe catching on to the fact that this this social media site is their own. Look, car fell out. I didn't need that. Nah nah. I didn't need that. And then a lot of you, and look, why the fuck? You know what I'm saying? Like, a lot of, like, somebody's watching them or catching on to the fact that they're lying. Somebody knows that somebody is lying about something. 
Like a lot of them not going, somebody's not going to see something coming. Like when this shit hit the fan, something about to hit the fan in reference to somebody stealing your identity, pretending to be you because they didn't know how popular you really was. They felt like nobody gave a fuck about you because you didn't really give them too much information into your life. You gave people what they wanted to see is what I'm hearing. Like you guys may have more than one social media page and they thought that you was a nobody. I don't know why I keep hearing that. Yeah. There's definitely like some type of female energy involved in this situation. Look, got played. Got played. Right? And they definitely suspect behind it. Okay? So this person that got played by this karmic masculine, this could be you or this person in question, this 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 clout chaser, this doppelganger, this this identity theft thief, this person that pretending to be you. This person definitely came in and around you trying to get more information or more, more clout off of you. Like, they were taking everything you had and was pretending that they had got it. Trying to make it seem like you was this hoe. Like, I keep hearing this, this bitch is a hoe. Like, why would you, why would you even believe her or even want to be with her? Like, this person's a hoe. This person's a hoe. Okay. Well, let me be a hoe. Like, let me be a hoe. All right. Let me be a ho ho. Spirit say split the deck. I'm going to split the deck. They want me to shuffle again. I'm saying my spirit guys be real specific, y'all. They be telling me to do certain shit. All right, now they say shuffle. So yeah, whoever this person is, they definitely feel like this person may have played them. Somebody feels played here. This could be you. Like y'all didn't see something coming. Like somebody is about to snitch on somebody because somebody found out that somebody was lying about their identity. Like I feel like when this person pulls up, this people be like, you're not the person in the picture. You couldn't be. Or something like something like that. You know how somebody be like, yo, you don't look like your picture. Like, this person is definitely trying to be you, is what I keep hearing. Like, this person wants to be you so bad. So, so bad. Yeah, this person is definitely wicked, too. Like, this energy is chaotic. Look, somebody's saying sorry. But it's sorry, it's too late now, because now your ass caught. Okay? Now your ass about to get caught because you done tried to steal somebody else's information. Because they know you are gifted. They want whatever you got. So that way they can build themselves up and try to break you down. If that makes sense for somebody. Look, social media. This card came out instantly. Social media. Okay? Suspicious behavior. Secretly stalking you. Okay? Look, spirits say germs from friends. And when I see card, when I see this card, I usually get the sense that this person is yucky. Like I said in the beginning of the reading, like somebody is bubblegum yum. Yucky. Like, you know what I'm saying? Definitely doing a lot of ass kissing to avoid getting in trouble in this situation. Like, this person definitely stole like stole your, your whole likeness. You know what I'm saying? Like the truth will set them free. Like somebody about to somebody about to get exposed. Because they've been stealing something from somebody. Like, I feel like somebody that, that you know, is a fan of yours or may follow you on social media is going to run into this situation on another website that they know you're not going to be on or that they know wouldn't be your your your, your stilo. Like, somebody, somebody is definitely doing something on some type of social media account that you wouldn't even be on. And I'm hearing OnlyFans, Pornhub. Somebody definitely got some videos up of you. Look, look at this suspicious behavior. Like somebody uh, caught on. Somebody caught on to this suspicious behavior. And they like, yo, you really tried to play play this person. You tried to really get over on this person. I feel like the police is going to get involved. I don't know why I keep hearing police are, police are watching. Police are watching. So somebody's definitely watching this social media account. Because somebody's been using your likeness. Um bastard <laughs> so somebody some this is how you feel about this person like this mother bastard i keep hearing somebody say this motherfucker like somebody definitely is about to pull the pull the the, the curtains back on this situation and somebody's about to get in real 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 trouble hot water somebody's in over their head hot water you know what i'm saying 
Look, you're gifted. They know you're powerful. You know what I'm saying? They want whatever you got. Okay? They want, look, at the bottom of that, designer clothes. Because you may, you may wear designer clothes. You may have a lot of money. You may have a lot of social media followers. I hear that somebody is an influencer and they're doing this to try to ruin your reputation or try to uh, try to put a stain on you. Try to put a stain on you in the community so that way people look at you differently because they feel like if they expose you, they can get paid for this. So they try to gain information. Look, rich, wealthy, because you may be rich or wealthy. You know what I'm saying? Like this, could, this, this is because you're rich, you're wealthy. You know what I'm saying? You have something that they don't have. Okay, and they want whatever you got. All right, they want whatever you got, even if it means you know, what I'm saying that later on down the line they might actually get caught. Is what I'm hearing spirits say, like this person doesn't even know how well protected you are. Like, your ancestors don't play about you. I keep hearing spirits say, Yeah, they don't know who they're dealing with, and I also hear this person may not have their may need a mental health check because they're not all, all upstairs either. This person may be all over the place. Yeah, they come off like they smart the whole time. They really dumb. This right here. Yeah, this person doesn't know what to do. Spirit said if you ask a question, the, the answer is yes. This person's a dark soul. This person's a dark soul. Like I said, this is a karmic. You know what I'm saying? This is a karmic. A karmic. They tried to get you set up. They're trying to set you up to hush you up. I keep hearing set you up to hush you up. You know what I'm saying? To get what you, to, to try to make money off of you by, by exposing you. But exposing you by setting you up and pretending to smile in your face at the same time. Okay? Look, spirits say they revenge backfired. They thought they were going to continue to get away. Because you can't, look, spirits say you can't fix stupid. <laughs> I'm done. I'm done. <laughs> My spirit guys is, is fucking me. Because a lot of you look throwing out the trash. Seriously, y'all about to throw out the trash on their ass. Because look, they thought they were chasing the dream the whole time. That shit about to go down the drain. Okay? That shit about to go down the drain. They ain't about to get catch none of your dreams. <laughs> okay? I hear somebody may be very cocky in this situation. Okay, very, very cocky. Ooh. Yeah, spirits say they cocky. They cocky. They don't know who they're dealing with. They stole from you and then tried to pretend like they didn't steal it. Like, I feel like some of you guys may have confronted this person. Like, yo, did you do what I think you did? And this person like, nah. Nah, I don't know what you're talking about. I don't know why I heard that. I don't know what you're talking about. You know what I'm saying? Look, spirits say this love is forbidden because this is not your true person. This person's a karmic. Karmic for real. Take the rose and flip them as they as, as they apply. But this person is definitely a karmic masculine or or, or or the such. Like, you know what I mean? They're not the true divine masculine. They're, they're a shadow masculine. They're not the true person. They pretended to be this person just to, just, just to you know what I'm saying, gain off of your momentum. Because I feel like a lot of you guys are, are rising stars. I keep hearing a rising star. So somebody that definitely has something going on with themselves or that you may be getting. It, it could be that you might be getting. You're very high ranked in your position at work. And they just they just want to bring you down because they're not getting any benefit from this. Okay. They're not getting any benefit from this. And they just want to bring you down in a sense. To try to stop, stop whatever blessings you got coming your way. I even hear that some of them even perform some type of black magic or some type of ritual to try to steal your money, to try to stop your money flow or to affect, affect your uh, the way that you feel about yourself. Like they, they try to target your your emotional, your emotional, your emotional side. Um, they even try to put a blinders on you. If that makes sense for somebody to try to get you to think that what you were thinking and feeling wasn't real. This car wants to can't real yeah, panties. They were trying to get you with your panties off. They were trying to get you with your panties off. Panties off. Panties off. They were trying to get you with your panties off. <laughs> I don't know why, I sing, why I'm singing that, but yeah. It's like 
That's how they feel. Every time they come around, they're like, ooh, I'm about to get me some. Ooh, I'm about to get me some. They don't even know what I'm about to do. Whole time, they don't even know what your ancestors about to do to them. <laughs> yeah, look. Spirit say this is a past life karmic that you're dealing with. So it's like this person has showed up in your life more than one time trying to ruin everything that you got going on because they're jealous as fuck. Okay, they got a lot of suspicious behavior. They might even be trying to kiss your ass and try to make you think that they ain't doing all this evil shit whole time. They the one behind all this bullshit that's happening on your social media while you're while you're constantly getting notifications that your email might have been changed. I'm hearing somebody's email was changed or was hacked. Somebody had to get a new account. They stole everything. They stole everything. And you had somebody had to start over. Okay, but I'm also hearing this person may have put your stuff up on social media, um, on like OnlyFans, Pornhub, some type of derogatory website that you wouldn't even be on because that's not what you do. Okay, you're in the business of positivity and raising your vibrations and trying to, you know what I'm saying, really make something happen for yourself. And this person has taken all of your, your shit, look. Money, 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 money. This person all about the money, 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 money. They trying to make money off of you by trying to set you up. I'm hearing hidden cameras. I'm also hearing that they even may have talked you into doing like some type of sex tape. Like, and this person tried to like, they tried to Kim Kardashian your ass. I don't even know they about to have you blow up. <laughs> like literally. Saturday may have been an important day for you. Like this could have been a day of discovery. This could be then, now, in the past, or in the future. But I'm here a day of discovery. Okay. Whoever this person is. Yeah. 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 Little spirit say what's done in the dark will come to the light. This person is stuck between a rock and a hard place. And they don't regret shit that they done. Because they feel like they're making money off of you. They making money off of, you know, whatever y'all two may have done together. Or whatever that they have on you. Okay. Like this person, you might be a teacher or a mentor. Like a lot of you guys are in very good positions where you have a public's eye on you. People, people look up to you. This could even be that your family looks up to you and they're just trying to humiliate you um, for a game. Um, I'm also hearing like blackmail as well, like trying to trick you and try to blackmail you into giving up something. Um yeah, whoever this whoever this energy is that I'm picking up on, this person is very demonic in the way that they do things. And they definitely working with another female. Like right? whoever this female female is, they're pretending, they're taking your image and pretending to be you. They pulling up on people at dates and shit, talking about they you. You not me. So this person may be a Virgo, Cancer, Sagittarius, Leo. I'm definitely getting heavy Gem Gemini um energy here. You know what I'm saying? Some of you guys may be in a position of getting a raise and they trying to stop that. Okay? My... Ugh. This person is demonic, y'all. Like, I'm not even being funny. Like, a lot of you guys be like, some of this person don't bother me. Look, yeah, it's spirit say it's time to change a fucked up situation. Spirit say check up on it, investigate. So a lot of you guys may have been tipped off to this situation and y'all are doing your own investigation because y'all are not about to have somebody destroy your image, your reputation that you worked so hard to gain and ain't nobody help you get to where you're at. I hear a lot of you guys got there on your own. Didn't nobody support you. You know what I'm saying? But now that you got to where you're at, now people want to support you. Okay? Spirit say y'all are getting back up and people want to bring you back down. And a lot of you guys are definitely in between relationships, whoever this message is for, because this is not somebody that you call your, your boyfriend is what I'm hearing. This is like somebody that you're seeing on and off, but yet they're trying to come off as a divine masculine the whole time. They're a karmic masculine, uh, portraying, because that's all they do. They're a thief. They're identity thief. Yeah. Paid a prostitute. So this person definitely got another female that they're paying to try to pretend to be you, this doppelganger trying to steal your identity, your social security card, your bank information, your name, anything that's related to you because they want to make you, they want to humiliate you. Look, spirits say AKA, it's a trap and they will stop at nothing to continue to try to bring you down in this situation because they're jealous. I'm hearing heavy, I'm, I, they're heavy on the jealousy. 
I don't know if the person that they're dealing with, I feel like this person may know you personally and it's like they sent this person to you or may have set you up with this person. This could be like a, a close family friend or a cousin. I'm here, a cousin or a brother. But somebody around you definitely sent this person to you and made you feel like you could trust this person because they, they were brought in by somebody that you knew and you felt like this person was had your best interest in mind the whole time. They all plotting on your downfall on all 20, 777. Like, this person is definitely plotting on your downfall. They want to take whatever they can get from out of you and try to bring you down to size because they don't want you up. Up, up on top. Some of you guys gonna be receiving some type of unexpected visit from the law because they're gonna be asking you, like, is this you? Because somebody been robbing people using your image, using your name, been doing shit using your name. I'm hearing fake ID. Yeah, somebody even create went as far as making a fake ID, fake passport, somebody traveling with your name. They going all around the city with your name. Whole time they're people the police they got involved. Police like um this, this this ain't this person. Yeah. Spirit said this ain't this person. Yeah, like I said, this person may be a Virgo, Sagittarius, Leo, Scorpio. Look, Sagittarius came out. You know what I'm saying? Look, they got sexually explicit photos of you trying to get, you know what I'm saying? Play your cards right. Look, try, try to play their cards right to try to get money off of your sexually explicit photos. And you don't even know that they're doing this. You thinking that they got your best interest the whole time. They really just got, just plotting on you. Plotting on you the whole time. Because they're jealous of you. They're jealous. Jealous as fuck. Spirit, clarify this. Uh, any more messages you have for the collective in reference to this situation. Thank you, Spirit. Yeah. Footprints, fingerprints. So I definitely feel like whoever this unexpected visit is coming from, they got proof. They got some type of proof that somebody has stolen your information. And you might have a clue. I hear you have a clue of who it might be. Because this person is close to you. You know this person. You know this person. You know who this person is that may have helped um, steal your identity, in a sense. Look, this person said, I told your secrets. So whoever this person is that's around you, they know all your secrets. They know your, a, a lot about your past. You know what I'm saying? This person definitely was stealing your identity, though. I keep hearing identity theft, identity theft, identity theft, doppelganger, doppelganger. Spirit keeps saying the same thing over and over again. This person is no good. And this person is still in your circle, too, smiling in your face, smiling in your face. You thinking it's just one person the whole time. It's a whole group. It's a whole damn group. They're stocking you up on your ass. Yeah, it could be this sisterly energy. It's like somebody's sister, cousin, that's a female, had brought this person into your life. So I'm like, yeah, this person's a good person. They'll definitely fit you. I think you guys would definitely look good together. Whole time, this person is jealous of fuck. This person is jealous as fuck. Look, spirits say beware of stranger danger. Because this person is danger. This person don't have nothing good to offer you but to try to uh, steal your likeness and try to stop your, your growth. And it's like whoever's attached to you that's around you, this family, cousin, or whatever, they're jealous of you. You know what I'm saying? They're jealous of you. Spirit say pull for these cards. Clarify. All right, yeah. They definitely jealous of you because they know that you're successful. They know you're powerful. They know you're gifted. They want whatever you got so they can gain from it. Look, cards came out. Ace of Cups, Six of Pentacles, Two of Cups, Eight of Cups. You know, you, do y'all see what I'm seeing here? Like this person is definitely trying to manifest like some type of. They're they're trying to manifest like some type of downfall for you. Like they're trying to manifest your downfall. But whole time with this Six of Pentacles here in this in this card right here. Like they're not they they have nothing but greed. They're nothing but it's nothing but greed here with this two of cups. This person this person don't like you for real for real. You know what I'm saying? They don't want no partnership with you for real for real. These cups empty as a bitch. Look at this eight of cups. This person this person trying to stop all all types of shit that's going on in your life by being vindictive, devious, uh, lying and deceiving, trying to take whatever they can from you. And whole time, they don't want the best for you. They just want whatever you they can get out of you. 
this person wants whatever they can get out of you so that way they can try to destroy you. Look at that, because they know that you're the, the high priestess. And look, you got the emperor reverse. This fake ass, this fake ass person want to be something that they can never be. Look at that. Six, huh, huh, huh. Look at that. Look at that, y'all. Do y'all see what I'm seeing? You got the six, you got the, the wands here, and this person is all in their feelings with this damn six of wands. And then you got this goddamn five of wands here. This person is deaf. This this four wands, like you got the four wands there. Like this person, I don't know why I keep saying five of wands. So I'm, I'm like, they're going through it. They're going through it. This person has no sense of balance, no sense of understanding, no sense of direction. They would never be you. They're trying to be you because they know that you're the high priestess and that you have the most that you're that you're powerful. That you're truly powerful. So they're trying to mimic you so that way they can steal whatever whatever uh, riches and joys and, and blessings that you, you have coming your way. I even hear a lot of them try to put spells on you to try to steal your image, beauty spells, all types of stuff. To try to make you feel like you're not the shit. You know what I'm saying? Look at this. Now I see this the nine of swords. This person is de dealing with heavy burdens now after trying to cross your, try to, try to be you. Try to be you. Okay, look, ten of swords, you know what I'm saying, four of swords, you know what I'm saying, ace of swords, this person is in crisis right now, because they ass about to get him to fuck up, you know what I'm saying, this person don't even know who they was dealing with, they didn't know how powerful your ancestors were, because they weren't going to play with you, they said you were meant to have these blessings, meant to be rained down on, you were meant to be rich, you were meant to have this money, you was meant to have this fame, and they're trying to stop this by trying to ruin your image, look at this, the chariot in reverse. Now they're trying to run for the hill. Now they're trying to run for cover. Whole time it ain't nowhere to hide because they about to get exposed for everything that they didn't did. And ain't no coming back. Okay? I hear ain't no coming back. They ass gone for a long time. Look at this. The hangman. They ass gone for a long time. They ass gonna be wishing and praying that they never even tried you. Look at this. Justice. Spirits say you're gonna be receiving the justice that you deserve because guess what? They getting judgment. They get a judgment. And this fake ass high priest is right here. This fake ass karmic masculine. His ass getting it too. Along with that person that he that he um had recruit him to come into your life. I hear recruited. Okay, I hear the word recruited. This person was chosen. Okay. So a lot of a lot of them is trying to revert, resort to their hermit mode, trying to trying to hide some shit, trying to make trying to play on your intelligence and shit, make it seem like they ain't got nothing, like they ain't did shit. Whole time you a whole puss. I hear puss. Okay, out of pentacles. Look at that. You see what I'm saying? This person definitely wants your wealth. They want whatever you got. They wanted whatever you got. And they was willing to stop at nothing to try to get it. But Spirit said they, you're going to re be receiving um, judgment. And I feel like a lot of you guys are going to be receiving some type of uh, some type of award because of this identity theft. Because it's a crime. So this person's going to owe you a lot of money. They're not going to get away with it. Spirit said they're not getting away with it. We're not be letting them get away with it. You know what I'm saying? We've been patient long enough. Look at this. Four cups in reverse. You know what I'm saying? Eight of Pentacles. You know what I'm saying? They wanted everything that you had. You know what I'm saying? Now they feel like they, they stuck between a rock and a goddamn hard place because they can't get nothing else out of you. Because somebody done put a stop to the, to the thievery. Somebody's about to snitch on somebody. It's either this karmic-ass sisterly energy or somebody... You know what I'm saying? About to snitch on somebody try to avoid a jail sentence. Because whatever they did definitely was criminal and inact. Is what I'm hearing. Like somebody definitely, definitely about to catch some heat behind this situation. Somebody's about to catch some heat. Somebody about to go down for the count. And they're not about to get back up. They're not about to get back up. They're going down. Is there any more messages for the um for clarification for the collective on this situation? On these last still and man's people. But we don't like them. My, like I'm getting frustrated with this because if I was you, I would have punched all of them in the face. No offense, because <laughs> that that right there is trifling. Yeah, Knight of Swords in reverse. It ain't it, <laughs> spirit making movement on that ass. Look at that. Page of sword. Page of swords. Cups. Knight of Cups. They're not playing. They're not playing with these people. They damn sure not playing with these people. They about to put their ass down. They about to put them down. Look at that. Ten of cups. You know what I'm saying? And you're going to be real happy. You're going to find your peace and serenity after all this shit is done. 
because you're gonna be sitting on cloud nine knowing that they ass sitting behind bars after trying to steal your identity posting you up on other social media accounts you know what i'm saying with they jealous ass because you up on your high horse and they want to try to bring you down look they don't even know you earned that horse <laughs> Okay, you earned that horse and they're trying to bring you down. They don't even have the room to even speak. They don't even have the room. Okay, they have no right. Spirit say leave it there. This person is going to wish that they never even tried you because they didn't know how powerful you really was until they started knocking on the wrong doors. You know what I'm saying? And so they, they still, huh? They, gave, they was given plenty of warnings to stop what they was doing. They was given plenty of time to, to, undo their, to undo their bullshit, but they refused. So Spirit said, we're going to show you what we, what we can do. We're going to show you what we can do. They put the right people in the right place at the right time to catch their ass in a lie. And now their ass became a suspect. Now they're under investigation. Now now, now somebody peeping game that somebody just stole, stole their information from them. Now they ass want to jump back and act like they ain't did nothing because they know you the high priest and that you're the powerful. You're powerful. You're, you're well off. You don't need nothing from nobody. And this fake ass goddamn Carmen mask and got the audacity to step in the picture like he's somebody because this fake ass cousin or friend or sister sent him your way. Nah, all y'all going to pay. And I feel like it's like multiple people involved. I feel like somebody's family even plotting on you. You know what I'm saying? The family plotting on you because you're not sharing your wealth. They say, oh, she being selfish. Or they being selfish. Or he being selfish. Well, let me be selfish because I earned this selfishness. Because when, when you was getting up there on that house, house, won't nobody there to help you. But guess what? These bastards that come from these broken homes. I keep hearing broken homes. You know what I'm saying? Will be, huh, huh. Gonna be saying sorry for a very long time. All that ass kissing that they about to be doing, try to get you to convince them not to put their ass behind bars. Guess what? I ain't gotta be convinced. I hear somebody say, I ain't gotta be convinced. The boys about to do it on their own because they scammed so many people using your identity. They did a lot of scamming, a lot of vindictive, um, devious shit, is what I'm hearing. Because they wanted to steal your wealth. They wanted to steal your wealth. They wanted to block your blessings. They wanted to stop your true masculine from coming in as well. Because they knew that if you were so entangled with this fake masculine. That you was never going to allow your real masculine to come in. Because you were entertaining somebody that was a fraud. All these people is fraud. Committing fraud with your name. With your identity. Using you to try to get up off of you. Because they want whatever you got. But not everybody going to be blessed with the same with that. Because they didn't earn that. 